get ready to learn some new facts, baby. They coming your way. Here are 50 amazing facts to blow your mind. On October 2nd, 1954, Elvis Presley made his first and last Grand Ole Opry appearance. Apparently, his gyration-filled performance was not received well, and one of the officials there reportedly told him to not quit his day job, which was driving trucks. Actor Brad Pitt's first acting job was playing a chicken. Yep, he wore a chicken suit to attract customers to an El Pollo local restaurant in Hollywood. Today, the 53-year-old actor has been in more than 70 movies, won an Academy Award out of five nominations, and more. American sprinter Forrest Smithson won a gold medal in the 110 meter hurdles in the 1908 Olympics, but what was really astonishing about it is that he was carrying a Bible in his hand. The common rumor is that he did this to protest against the decision to run the finals on Sundays. However, the truth is, he was so religious that he often ran with a Bible. While editing his biggest movie, The Titanic, director James Cameron taped a razor blade to the side of the computer with instructions that says use only if the film sucks. But he didn't need to worry very much because the film went on to gross a total of $1.84 billion worldwide. In 2008, a 57-year-old Chicago school bus driver and amateur artist, Steve Kushner, changed his name legally to In God We Trust. He did this because it symbolizes the help that God gave him during tough times. But I don't think he thought it through very much. I mean, I feel like having your first name as In God would make for some awkward social situations. Yo, In God, what up? An underground fire in the coal mines beneath Centralia, Pennsylvania has been burning since 1962. Astonishingly, nobody knows how the fire even started, but one theory is that burning trash from a nearby landfill accidentally ignited coal beneath the old entrance to the mine. From there, the fire spread wildly through all the mines. The world's longest yard sale, known as the 127 sale, occurred between August 4th and 7th of 2016 and extended over 1,000 kilometers throughout four states. People selling goods lined the roadside along the US Highway 127 and the Lookout Mountain Parkway all the way through Covington, Kentucky, Gadsden, and Alabama. At the 2008 Olympics in Beijing, China, visitors could buy seahorse kebabs and deep fried scorpion. And if that wasn't weird enough, it's estimated that up to 40,000 restaurants ended up adding crazy twist menu items such as this. According to Dr. Scott Pitnick at Bowling Green State University in Ohio, the tiny fruit fly Drosophila bifurca develops huge testicles that make up almost 11% of its body weight in order to produce giant sperm. They can produce sperm that are more than 20 times the size of their own bodies. What? That's disturbing. Ellen Church was the first female flight attendant who began flying in 1930. She implemented a plan that required all flight attendants to be registered nurses, which was a great idea except when World War II began, all of the nurses enlisted in the war, so most airlines were forced to drop their requirement in order to find any workers. The burger with the most calories in the world can be found at the Heart Attack Grill in Las Vegas. According to the owner, John Basso, the octuple bypass burger is 20,000 calories. The restaurant ended up making national headlines for literally killing its customers, so fittingly, the waitresses are all dressed as nurses. There was an ancient Chinese custom where girls would have their toes and arches broken, tied, and bound underneath their feet before the arch of the foot could develop. This was done so that their feet could fit into tiny little shoes. Back then, small feet in China represented the height of female refinement. There is a phobia called Kampunaphobia where sufferers have a paralyzing fear of buttons. The specific fear varies from person to person, but some people feel that buttons are dirty and some are afraid of the texture of certain buttons. According to the US Department of Treasury law, portraits of living persons are prohibited from appearing on government securities like money. This is why you never see living presidents on dollar bills. In addition, the portraits have to be of deceased people whose places in history are well known by the American people. A woman named Vesna Vulovic from Yugoslavia holds the Guinness World Record for the highest fall survived without a parachute. On January 26, 1972, she was working as a flight attendant when she fell over 10,000 meters over the Czech Republic. Unbelievably, the plane that she was working aboard blew up and she fell inside a section of the tail unit. After being in the hospital for 16 months and emerging from a 27-day coma, she had multiple broken bones but miraculously survived. Ontario, Canada has more than 
250,000 lakes and contains about one-fifth of the entire world's fresh water. It was also the place that I was raised. Well in Ontario represent? NASA scientists have discovered that about 4.3 billion years ago, Mars may have had enough water to cover its entire surface in a liquid layer about 137 meters deep. This primitive ocean would have held more water than the Arctic Ocean. However, over time, it lost about 87% of that water into space. Researchers from the French University, University Libre de Bruxelles, found that cockroaches have their own personalities and even display different character traits. They are simple animals, but they can make complex decisions on survival, and one cockroach's decision can actually sway another's. Japan has the highest life expectancy in the world at almost 84 years on average. This is mostly due to Okinawa Island, which is known for having some of the longest living people in the entire world. In fact, there are 34 centenarians per 100,000 people, which is more than three times the rate of mainland Japan. In 2008, a man named Ian Usher from Perth, Australia sold his entire life on eBay for $399,000 following the breakdown of his marriage. The sale price included his home, his car, his motorcycle, a two-week trial in his job, and an introduction to his friends. For five years, a woman named Oksana Malaya from the Ukraine lived with dogs and survived on raw meat and scraps. She walked on all fours, panted with her tongue hanging out, and whined and even barked. After she was abandoned by her alcoholic parents, she was actually raised by a pack of dogs on a rundown farm in the village of Novaya. When she was finally discovered in 1991, she had almost forgotten how to speak. Naples, Italy has set a world record for producing the world's longest pizza. It measures, prepare yourself, about 1,854 meters long and took about 100 chefs 11 hours to make. It took 2,000 kilograms of flour, 1,600 kilograms of tomatoes, 2,000 kilograms of cheese, and 200 liters of olive oil just to make it. The esophagus of a leatherback sea turtle is lined with papillae, sharp prongs that enable the turtle to dine on jellyfish. And you thought turtles were cute. On May 17th, 2016, a woman named Mary Ann Noland had her obituary published in the Richmond Times, which stated that faced with the prospect of voting for either Donald Trump or Hillary Clinton, she literally chose to die. Yeah, I think more than a few people felt that way, you know what I'm saying? Budweiser changed its name to America for the summer of 2016. Yes, it literally changed the labels on all bottles and cans with images and phrases affiliated with the United States. The controversial campaign was called America in Your Hands and was run from May 23rd to November of 2016. On May 19th, 2004, a boa constrictor triggered a 15-minute nationwide blackout in Honduras when it got itself trapped between two enormous generation units. The boa was electrocuted and the resulting short circuit caused the emergency system to shut down the entire plant which shut down the country's electricity. In 1992, locals from Zernico, Germany discovered a 100 tree swastika during an aerial survey. The swastika was made up of a group of larch trees only visible from the air and was almost 19 square meters. In autumn, the yellowing trees stand out against the surrounding evergreens. Nobody knows who planted these trees, but it is known that it was created during Hitler's peak in the 1930s. The world's largest pool is in the seaside resort of San Alfonso del Mar in Chile. It was built in 2006 and is 35 meters deep and is filled with, get this, 249 million liters of water. Scientists at Duke University have developed a device that allows monkeys to control robotic wheelchairs by sending signals with their brains. They're hoping that one day it will help people with disabilities. Shiaya Taiwan built a 17 meter glass structure shaped like a giant high heel shoe. It's used as a wedding hall and a tourist attraction. It was built in honor of women who suffered from arsenic poisoning from well water that caused gangrene, a condition sometimes known as black feet disease. 36-year-old Wang Zayu is a Chinese hairstylist trained in the art of Kung Fu. He cuts hair while standing on his head. Not only does the Earth spin on its axis, it also moves around the sun at a speed of about 107,800 kilometers an hour. That's real fast. In 1984, Jack LaLanne, sometimes referred to as the godfather of fitness, towed 70 rowboats with passengers in them from Queen 
Queensway Bridge to the ship Queen Mary while shackled, handcuffed, and fighting winds and currents. And he did this on his 70th birthday. I suddenly feel the need to go to the gym. The Paku fish, native to South America, was found in New Jersey in June of 2015. It's a relative of the flesh-eating piranha and is known for its distinctive teeth which bear an eerie resemblance to human teeth. Luckily, the Paku fish is not gonna bite your face off because it primarily eats plants and is considered mostly harmless to humans. Mostly. Mm -mm. If your name is Isabella, you get a free lifetime admission to the Isabella Stewart Gardner Museum in Boston. How exciting. United Kingdom based horticulture company Thompson & Morgan has developed a plant that grows both cherry tomatoes and potatoes. It was developed in Canada and has been called the ketchup and fries plant and can be bought in Canadian Costco retailers and even in some independent garden centers. Some children in southwest China between the ages of 6 and 15 have to scale a cliff about 800 meters high multiple times a month in order to get to their school. The school, located in Atular Village takes about 90 minutes to get to. Yeah, catching the bus in the morning doesn't sound so bad now, does it? Mm -hmm. Cincinnati surgeon Dr. Henry Heimlich, the man credited for developing the Heimlich Maneuver, actually used it himself for the first time in his life on May 26, 2016. He saved a woman that was choking at his senior center. He was 96 years old. There is a species of orchid that only grows at high elevations in certain mountainous areas of Ecuador, Colombia, and Peru that looks just like a monkey. <laughs> In 1972, Curtis King built his son a spaceship house in the woods near Signal Mountain, Tennessee, where they live. It has a drop-down staircase and every detail channels futuristic living and it even costs $250,000 to build. And it's no joke, it has three bedrooms, two bathrooms, a full bar, even though I don't understand why his young son would need that, and an entertainment area. He eventually sold the house and it can now be rented for a futuristic vacation. Researchers at Norway Norway's University of Virgin have found a link between being addicted to work and anxiety. They looked at more than 16,000 workers across the country and found that nearly 8% of workaholics were more likely to suffer from ADHD, OCD, depression, and anxiety. They also found that people who work more than 55 hours per week were at a higher risk of heart attack and stroke. Believe it or not, Nintendo was originally a playing card company founded in late 1889. It was based in Kyoto, Japan and produced and marketed a game called Hanafuda. In fact, Nintendo continues to manufacture playing cards in Japan and even organizes its own tournament called the Nintendo Cup. According to a study done in 2002 by Daphne Sorez from the University of Maryland, an American alligator can orient themselves to the ripples created by a single drop of water even in complete darkness. This is because their faces and bodies are covered with tiny bumps that are far more sensitive than our own fingertips. In May of 2016, President Barack Obama became the first active president to visit the Japanese city of Hiroshima since the bombing 71 years ago. Happy hour has been illegal in the Republic of Ireland since 2003 under the Intoxicating Liquor Act. Ah, Pog Mahon! In 2006, a flight from Washington to Dallas was forced to land in Nashville because passengers could smell burning matches. As it turns out, a woman with a medical condition was lighting matches to cover her own body odor. In case you didn't know, lighting matches on a plane is super illegal. Candace Payne, a Dallas mother of two, broke the Facebook Live video record as the most watched video on the platform ever. She shared a live video of herself in a Chewbacca mask, laughing hysterically at the voice the mask makes. And you've probably seen this video because as of the time of this recording, the video has gained over 164 million views and has been shared almost 3.4 million times. Rodents are incapable of vomiting. That's something you needed to know. Really though, they can't puke because of anatomical constraints. In other words, they simply aren't built with the ability to. In 1848, an ice jam up the river from Niagara Falls caused the falls to stay bone dry for nearly 48 hours. Some people actually took it as a sign that the world was ending and attended special services at local churches. Normally, it has the highest flow rate of any waterfall in the world and provides 4.4 gigawatts of energy to the region. In 
2008, Burger King introduced a new product for the Christmas season called Flame, a meat-scented cologne for meat-loving men. It was promoted as the scent of seduction with a hint of flame-broiled meat. Nope. And now you're just a little bit smarter. But thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to subscribe to my channel because I release a new video Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. If you want to watch more, you can press or click either of the two video thumbnails that you see on your screen right now. And don't forget to check out my second channel. The link is in the description. Have a fantastic day, and I will see you on Tuesday. Bye! Bye!